Okay. Well, let's finish up here with, like, once again, like, I've been trying to get on this so we can get past it. Okay. Modern Warfare 3. Are you guys, like, I know you guys are probably going to end up, like, you're like, yeah, I'm going to buy it, but are you interested in it? Like, do you want to yeah. see what they have to offer? I'm a little worried about it, to be honest. Yeah, I'm, wor I'm definitely worried. I'm very, very worried about it. Not, I'm definitely just, worried. not just multiplayer, but the game as a whole. <laughs> I want to see what happens. Like it's supposed to be supposedly like that's the rumor. I don't know. I don't know if they actually release anything saying yes, it's going to be about ghosts. But I, uh, if it is, I'm really interested in the story. Yeah. I'm kind of, but uh, I also, I also kind of hope that they like you know finish up Modern Warfare Two story because if it is about ghosts, then you already know there's going to be a Modern Warfare Four or something. He died. <laughs> spoiler. <laughs> he died. Spoiler. He died. Yeah, okay, that that one's not even a spoiler. That's, that's I would not hate a it spoiler. if it's the same story like as Modern Warfare 2. But huh? I would hate it if it's Modern Warfare 2, but in Ghost's point of view. Yeah, I'm it, getting I, so mad. The well, thing is, Infinity Ward isn't doing the online. Mm. What? Story mode, I think, will be a little oh. bit different because Ghost is in certain. He was only in certain things there. Like, uh, he was only in certain places. Like, you, in Modern Warfare 2, you played, like, as both those people, and you got to see everything. Ghost only saw certain stuff, and he, there might have been things that he saw that we didn't get to see. Probably. So, I'm, I'm thinking they're probably going to focus on what he got to see and we didn't get to see. Like, if, if that's well, what... I want to see the ending. Did that's they the catch idea. all the bad guys? <sighs> yeah. That's, that's, that's what, what I, I wish. Know. That's what I wish. Will they get but, Makarov or whatever his name is? Yeah. What I'm, like, personally, though, what I'm most interested in is what is the online going to be like, though? Because Infinity War, thank Back God, right. isn't doing it. That dude's a douchebag. Right. <laughs> I, ho I hope it's good, though, because I'm a Call I of Duty player. They don't have nukes. My God, please. Yeah. And no stackable kill streaks. Just saying that. was that. terrible. And certain people, like, no offense to those commentators. I, I think it's going to be like this. What? I'll let you go first. No, noobs are noobs are the shit. Noob <laughs> tube what? shit? What? <laughs> noobs are the shit. Are you serious? They're terrible. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> Nobody likes nukes. Yeah. I I remember that like there were certain commentators though saying like and no offense to them, but they were saying they liked the stackable kill streaks and I don't get how you could like it. I don't. I mean it's like, you, you're not all you gotta do is get five kills. You get two kills of Predator Missile. You get your Harrier. Your Harrier gets you two Chopper, and all of a sudden you had a good game. What was that? Huh? I like it. I, I did. Didn't. It's like you're not even earning it. You're just using your kill streaks to earn it. Yeah. I mean, you can like well, you can get like a five-man like kill it. with a with a Predator Missile. And go I thought all the, the way Predator was room. fun. I thought it was cool to use and everything, but the fact that they could stack on top of each other, I didn't like. That's why I like um, Black Ops, where you can't do it. Yeah, I mean, I wish we had like the Predator missile back, like in Black Ops or something. But I'm happy that they don't stack, personally. Yeah, I use that with the Valkyrie. I make it like a Predator. Just ah, shoot no, it straight no, up, not, straight not the same. It's not the same woman. Okay. Well, they had different like, <laughs> and the only lethal one up to five, I think. It should. Until you get the nukes. I, no I just, nukes. I'm praying there's not nukes though. Mm, no. I just yeah, it, it, it only, if there is nuke, if there is, is, it should be like non stack Killstreaks. Yeah. And the 25 killstreak without all the other ones. Yeah, that'd well, be like, because then nukes would be what they're supposed to be, like a once in a lifetime thing, like you only get it every so often. But the problem with that is, though, also, that will promote camping again. That's one of the big things that I think got campers in the modern world to was they wanted their nuke, so they'd camp. So having such a high up kill streak I think sort of ruins it. That's why I like dogs. Personally, in my opinion, like, you know, dogs and gunship, I think personally anybody can earn it eventually. Just running around, running, gunning, you can still earn it. You it's know what they should do? Really hot. They should do, like, they should do something like Battlefield, too. Like, we can, like, destroy walls so you can, like, get through places easier. Oh, so, yeah. Like, that'd that, be won't cool. work for, that won't work for Call of Duty. Call of Duty has too small of a map. Yeah. So it, it, won't, well, it won't work for Call of Duty. Because Battlefield yeah. has That's true, really because, big like, maps. And Especially if people like were to noob tube in Call of Duty and destroy wall walls like that, three minutes into the game, it'd be a flat battlefield. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't, I'm just saying though, just because like 
It would be easier to kill all the campers and all that. That's what's good about so. bad company and battlefield games, because it's impossible to camp. Exactly, yeah. This is, like, this is a uh, sort of a unusual idea, I guess, but maybe like p implement something that like if you sit in one place for over 10 seconds you just automatically die you blow up <laughs> like if you didn't take a single step or something like that within 10 seconds you die like ugh, like you just suddenly die well, that's actually die. kind of a good That'd idea be hilarious. i mean i think 10 seconds and all you gotta do is take one step within that amount of time is more than fair <laughs> so the only problem, the only problem know, with that being story. is if like you aren't at the controller, like let's say, like somebody came over or something like that, and like all of a sudden you gotta go away from the controller for a second, or you gotta go to the bathroom. Can't go to the bathroom. Yeah, well, yeah, or seconds. that. But I think that would also, you know, make people go like, oh shit, well I gotta do something now. Get out of the game. Don't just sit there and be AFK and screw my team over. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I do different. think it would be a good. I think it might be a possible idea. I, I think there might be flaws with the idea, but I think it's a possibility they could look into. Mm. But whatever. They should also do something about the rage quitting. Ah. Uh, yeah, yeah, but here's my biggest thing. Get second chance, last time, whatever the fuck you're going to call it, get that out of there. It's flawed. It's flawed. It's terrible. Because the, the thing is, if anybody else, if they weren't using that, would have died, you would have got your kill streak. But if they kill you or somebody else kills you and they're not down, you don't get your kill streak. If they're going to keep it in there, at least make it so that if you, if you down them, you earned your kill streak. Like, like you get your kill you streak. Yeah, before you have to finish them, them off. Yeah. yeah, before you finish them off, even. You earned your kill streak because anybody else would have been dead. That's true. I've got killed trying kill to them. shoot a second chance guy. It's not Oh, fun. yeah. I've gotten killed so many times, like one or two away from dogs trying to get some second chance noob. Yeah. Because they they uh, have that invis invincibility thing going on and it's like ridiculous. Yeah, like, and it can't go away. Yeah. I mean, if they put it away, it'd be completely useless because then you wouldn't even get down. People would shoot you as you're going down if they knew that because they'd know it then and you wouldn't even make it to the ground alive. <laughs> you would never pull your pistol out. Your pistol wouldn't, it wouldn't matter. It'd yeah. be useless. So they, I personally, I feel they just need to take it out altogether. It screws up everything. It's just I a agree. flawed perk. Especially when they're down on a flag during domination. That just screws you over so much because they can still cap yeah. the flag. Like, I mean, I'm not asking Black Ops to take it out, but maybe they should make it that if you're in second chance on a flag, it doesn't, it, you know, it doesn't get the flag. Get the flag. Yeah. 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 That would be something that, like, you know, at least fix it a little bit. I mean, I know you're not going to take it out, Black Ops at least wise, but fix it maybe and make it so that they can't get the objective while on second chance. Mm -hmm. That would be, I'd be a little happier then. I wouldn't mind it as much anymore. But uh, that's besides the point. Whatever, I don't care about that. But, uh...